We want to show the easiest way to install the pins uh, in the chain for the link lock. The first thing to do is put the bent side of the pin in a vise with protective jaws and the washer at the top of the top of the jaws. The next thing that you're going to do is you're going to take your chain and you're going to put the second link onto the pin. That makes it much stronger. And for one of the chains you're going to want the link weld on the left side and for the other chain you're going to want the link weld on the right side. Doesn't matter which one you do first, just one needs to be one way and one needs to be the other way so that the weld can be away from the tongue uh, when you install them into the link lock sleeves. The next thing that you're going to do is take the lanyard. It has a larger loop and a smaller loop. You're going to take the smaller of the loops and put that over the pin. The next thing that goes on is the washer. And then finally is the toothed washer. The toothed washer goes on with the teeth angled upwardly and you just set that on the top like that and the easiest way we have found to install that is using a piece of half inch PVC pipe cut to two and a half inches long for the 5 16 link lock and three inches long for the 3 8 link lock and all you do is you take and you put that on top of the washer and take your hammer and hammer that down until the pin comes to the top of the uh, PVC pipe and that will have it uh, installed in just the right position. The final thing to do is take your R pin and connect that to the other end of the stainless steel lanyard. Then you do that for the other chain and you're ready to install the chains uh, into the link lock sleeves.